You can download the answer in the video for free, link in the description, put 9 slice UI in Godot to create a visual for using 9 slicing, add a 9 patch rect to the scene. You could then send the texture to the container image that you can download for free, link in the description. We will set the texture filter to nearest as we're using pixel art. Then select edit region, make sure it's set to grid snap with a step of 1 pixel by 1 pixel. You can use scroll wheel to zoom in and zoom out. Then we will drag the orange circles to make sure we select the correct container. The edit region component is only needed in the case that you have multiple containers or other art inside of a single large image that you want to use. After the image has been selected, under patch margin we need to tell Godot how many pixels from each side until we reach the centerpiece which for this container is two on the left two on the top two on the right and three on the bottom you should then be able to resize this container as you would like additionally under axis stretch you can change the horizontal and vertical to three different options stretch stretches the image in the middle by all sides tile will tile the center image like a tile in a tile map layer and tile fit will do the same as tile but will also cause the center image to increase in size so that it fits the center then to have a button or any control inherited or green node also have nine slice imagery or a button button, under theme override, styles, for any of the styles, select style box texture, then set the texture to the container image that you can download for free, link in the description. Make sure to set the texture filter of the node to nearest, as this is not an available setting underneath the style box texture. Then under sub region, select edit region, like before drag the orange circle to select the correct container, then press close. Then under texture margins for this container, we'll set it to 3 on the left, 2 on the top, 3 on the right, and 5 on the bottom. You can also change the axis stretch and other properties like before, as well as the color modulate and the content margins. Now you have a simple 9 slice UI that you can add to any of your Godot games. And don't forget, then you can check out the project files, link in the description.